So this is a uh, series of stretches that I like to do uh, predominantly before training, but you can do it any time. Uh, but I like this one because it sort of gets all the um, muscles moving and active. Um, so, so what you do is you start with uh, two legs straight, band around the balls of the feet, and then around the back. Now, with this one you can bring the band higher up the back to get more of a stretch through the hammies. Um, and the whole idea of this one is to let the tension of the band uh, bring you forward. So you relax forward and let the tension of the band get a good stretch through the hammies. Um, now it's important that you have a good band with like a, a really good tension. Um, a lot sort of lose their tension and, and the stretch is not so effective. Um, and, and you kind of lose the whole idea of having the band. So you've got to make sure you get, get one with a really good quality tension through it. And you allow it to bring you forward. And then what I like to do is get a nice neural stretch through the hammy. So um, to do that, I do a few uh, chin to chest. And that, that gets a nice neural stretch through the hammy. So as the band's going forward, what you, 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 you allow that to take place. And you do about, I do about five chin to chest. Um, from there, I take one foot out. And what I do for the series is I do both sides, but I'm just going to run you through one side for now. Um, and then I come onto my back, and same again, let the band bring the stretch through the hammy, and it's nice and uh, really good tension. So it's a really good stretch through here. Um, probably hold that for about 10 seconds or so. Uh, and then out to the side, and get a good stretch through the abductor. And, and all the while we're doing this, these different positions, the hammy and the calf are getting a good stretch. Um, and then you can do a few uh, sort of calf pumps, uh, get the calf firing, um, get that ready to go. You can do a little knee tuck there, sort of get the quad going and it kind of gets a bit more stretch as well through the back of the knee, which is good. Um, so you can do a few of those. And you come back over to the other side. And same again, let the band keep it all nice and straight and and this get a good stretch through the hammy and through the glute and through the lower back. Um, same again, you can hold that for 10 seconds or so. You can do a few more knee tucks. Um, and with this one, uh, because the band's got a nice tension, what you do is you, you tilt your foot in that way and you get a nice stretch through the outside of the calf. Um, and then you can go the other way also for the inside. Um, and yeah, that just gets everything stretched and fired and ready to go. Um, and from there, yeah, just come up, swap sides, and I run through the same thing again on the other side.